<laughs> no, you were a little early, that's okay. Guess what's happening today? It's what? the warm-up day for Carpet Fest. Who doesn't like to start out their baby with a little, start out their baby? Who doesn't like to start out their day with a little bit of baby laughs and giggles and snuggles? I think that's a great way to start your day. Huh, T? Look at how clean it is back. Blowing out the microphone, bro. Carpet Fest. What do you know? I know. What about a reptile? But there's snakes, there are lizards, and there are elders, nose pickers. There are turtles and tortoises, and there are a lot of big turtles and tortoises, and a lot of big lizards, and a few they venomous you, lizards, and a few venomous snakes, and a lot of big snakes, and that's all I know. What? Do you know? I know. Honey badgers. Honey badgers? Yeah. What about honey badgers? That they like honey and a bird is attracted to them and honey badgers, honey badgers eat honey and they get sticked up by, by bees and that's all I know. Mushy. What do you know? You guys see how clean it is back there? It's all Hollywood magic and lies. Best way to poop on your face. Today is the setup day for Southwest Carpet Fest that we're hosting here. My buddy Bradley is on his way from, I believe he flew in from Arkansas, if I'm not mistaken, right Bradley? Texas. Four or five other people coming up. My buddy Jake, uh, Brandon, and Cher, and Tony, and uh, Garrett. Garrett's coming today. The highlight of the day for me today is gonna to be having so many people to <laughs> hold my snakes so I can film them. Because my favorite time to film the snakes is when I have other people to hold them and I can just focus on getting the shot instead of trying to, you know, wrangle the snake and film it at the same time. So I'm looking forward to that. Also, just looking forward to having a great time. Uh, I have a lot of people coming through and I like having a party. Should be fun. Tia, are you ready to party? Party, 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 party. Bye-bye, bye-bye. Mm. I've also got a surprise to show you down in the snake room. I don't think she's blamed for those So that look that she's giving Bradley is, uh, is the look that I think that any father would appreciate his daughter giving any man that comes into the house at any point in time, age one, age 13, age 17, I don't care. That's the look I want to see her give every single male that comes through this door. That's... Well... I don't know if you can see it, but there's a hole right here that she's just pierced right through with that everlasting gaze. Of... Are you gonna hide down the dark hallway? Is the carpet fest starting? The second that Bradley walked through the door, carpet fest started. How many more people? I think we're expecting maybe like 30 people. 30 people? I think 30 people is about that, yeah. <laughs> More people are coming. I think something like that. I think one of them might be calling me right now. Uh, we had our friend Vivi, uh, she's local here in Paso. She yesterday we went over and she let the boys play with all their geckos and gave us some cockroaches. We got some dubias and we got some of these hissing cockroaches that we can bring to the educational shows now as a extra type of animal pretty freaking cool man i'm not gonna lie i never thought that i'd keep a cockroach as a pet but you know what i never thought a lot of things about life oh he's nibbling me <laughs> he's just crawling on you this is his legs her legs that's a female do the females not have all those stripes no uh, the females don't have the horns what horns like the male has some horns on it i'll show you I think it's just like he's just holding on. No, he's biting me. <laughs> Let me see. Get him off. <laughs> it's not biting you, it's just the legs holding on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> 
cockroach in the room. His antenna are huge compared to him. His antenna are like as long as his, and his, They're still his young, huh? entire body. What do you think, Noah? Yeah, this is cool. It's like holding a giant sand crab. There's a swarm of them. Which ones are the females and which ones are the males? That I don't know. Oh, the males have wings, actually. It's, a, it's like a fungal infection on the skin. They get stuff like that sometimes, not just retics, but snakes in general. People kind of freak out about this. They don't, they don't know what to do, but you get the medicated foot powder for athlete's foot. <laughs> oh, so you were, you were already doing it? <laughs> or is this for eggs? That's for your mom. I'm sorry. I don't <laughs> <know>. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there you go. There you go. You catch it early, it's not a big deal at all. Hey, Garrett, so I told everybody that you were going to... Make me look bad with the pipe. Okay. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have to do it right this second. We're going to go get groceries taken care of. I really want to get everybody outside with like some snakes little... and get some nice shots. Everybody I holding snakes like would be cool. We're not getting the snake I like it. We need a little more liquid right courage now. before we start playing with pies. Yeah, no, we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna go to the store, get supplies for tomorrow, and then we'll come back in. Grab some snakes, bring them out front. I'll get my glide cam out. I use my own liquid ah. courage. <laughs> so what's that? In really dangerous yeah, situations, oh I ooze my own liquid courage. Das Keg hat den Betapis on the deed. So you're gonna take out the the pie after you finish that, or you want to handle it today, or you want to handle it tomorrow? This is like my handicap. If I'm weighed down, heavy after eating. Then, um, you know, obviously I have to get my personal protection gear on like you do. But if I weigh myself down, slow my reflexes a little bit, then we can compare apples to apples with your previous videos of handling her. You remember what I told you guys yesterday about all this uh, knowledge and experience and how it was going to be getting in my way? This is what I'm talking about. Of the knowledge and experience, just right out the door. Bye, Eli. Bye. Garrett just uh, brought up the point that there's probably a lot of people coming tomorrow that want to see him handle the pie expertly. So we're going to wait till tomorrow for that to happen. So tune in tomorrow for that. But right now, we're going to show lots of people holding lots of really cool snake in very, very beautiful cinematic fashion. Right, Eli? So this is the nice precursor to Carpet Fest going on. Garrett just did a nice introduction for everybody here. So if you should go check out his video that he's putting out on this day, because he's not filming tomorrow. Because in his own words, he's too lazy and doesn't want to work. But <laughs> if you, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all those really cool snakes in cinematic fashion. This is the most people I've ever had holding my snakes at one time outside my house. Before it's been like two people maybe. Now we've got a whole plethora and tomorrow is going to be even more. I'm ready for that. I'm ready for that. 
In the meantime, I hope you guys are having a great day, and uh, I hope we get to see you tomorrow too for the full festivities of Carpet Fest. I can already tell right now that I do not want this weekend to be over, and it's just getting started. So I'm just going to try and enjoy it as much as possible. Bring you guys along tomorrow, of course, but uh, until we see you then, aloha. That's a big, beautiful girl right there. Oh, huh, carrot. You're a good carrot. <laughs>